Today was an emotional homecoming for the independence officer shot in the line of duty. Officer Wagstaff spent the past eight months at a rehabilitation center in Nebraska after being shot in the head in the line of duty. 41 Action News reporter Sarah Plague joins us now live from the Independence Police Department where the welcome home ceremony wrapped up. Sarah. Well, it was such a wonderful thing to see all those people taking time out of their day to come and welcome home Officer Wagstaff. His recovery is something we've all been following for such a long time, and many were saying it's a miracle that he got to come back. Just so excited for independence that Officer Wagstaff's able to come home and that they're giving him a hero's welcome because he really deserves it. <laughs> People lined the streets in front of Independence Police Headquarters, carrying handmade signs, waving the American flag, filled with anticipation. Oh, it's Good News Friday. <laughs> Waiting to welcome home Officer Tom Wagstaff, who is finally back after a long recovery. He was shot in the head while responding to a home invasion last March. It's not just about the police department being out here, it's about, you know, the citizens and the city. He's here to, he worked for the city, he was here to helping the citizens and now they're here to support him and I think that's unbelievable. Somebody brought this journal so folks could fill the pages with a nice note or well wishes. And we're so proud of our hero, our hometown hero. Officer Wagstaff and his family were escorted back to Independence from the rehab facility in Nebraska, surrounded by fellow police officers. Thank you all for coming out. It's really great to be back. He stopped and waved to the crowd, flashing a big smile and a thumbs up. I think it's great and I think it's really fantastic that the community is coming out here to encourage him and like bringing him home. It's always beautiful when somebody comes out of it like this and, and comes <laughs> back to, to his hometown, especially at Christmas time. And there's another big welcome home event tomorrow and we will definitely have coverage on that here on 41 Action News. Here in Independence, I'm Sarah Plake, 41 Action News.